So on our Azure SQL databases, I discovered that most of the compatibility levels are 140 and 150. I would try to, I'd like to try to move to 160, hoping it'll make queries run faster. Is this a false hope? So the cool thing is, is that you can do that with uh, query hints. If you have a query that you want to test, there are query hints for which compatibility level you want to use. So you can opt in at the query level to compat level 160. The reason why I would try it with query hints first is that if you don't test all of the queries in your workload, you're going to find that some can work slower instead of faster. Change equals risk. Uh, so I, I don't want to just change just for the sake of changing and blindly hoping things will work faster because they, they probably will not across the board universally. Some stuff will work faster. Some stuff that used to be uh, fast can now be slower. So try opting in at the query level. If that works, great. Use that query hint and then that, those queries that you're concerned about will be faster without you having to test lots of different queries.